Welcome back. In this video, we're going to talk about quantization and how to quantize. First question is, what is it? Quantization is adjusting MIDI recorded rhythms to be mathematically perfect or on the grid. Recording something and fixing the rhythm to make it perfectly on the grid. Before we talk about how to do it, let's talk about what it cannot do. You can't quantize audio recordings in Soundtrap. Just MIDI and just software instrument recordings can be quantized, not audio recordings. Another thing quantization is not is it does not create new rhythms. It just takes the rhythms that you've recorded and fixes them or aligns them to the grid. So how does quantization work? The first step is to play and record something using a software instrument, and then you go to quantize it to a chosen rhythmic value. If that doesn't make sense, that's okay. We're gonna jump into Soundtrap now. I'm gonna show you how to do it. I think it'll be clear then. So now that you understand the theory of what quantization is, let's look at how to do it in Soundtrap. So remember, I need a MIDI instrument or a software instrument, not an audio channel. So I'll say add new track, and I'm gonna add a piano, and then I'm gonna play something, and I'm purposely gonna play it with not so great rhythm and then we'll see how to quantize it once I've done that. So here we go, I've got my metronome on so I know where the beat is, and I'll click record, and here I go. Okay, so you'll hear that was not perfect, and I can see that it's not perfect. The way that I'm looking at this, by the way, is click on piano roll, or if you don't see this, you can come up here and say edit, edit notes, and that will pull up the piano roll. So now I can see these first two notes are pretty good, these are pretty good, but then look at that one. It's a little bit early. It's a little bit to the left of that line. Pretty good, pretty good. This one's a little bit late. You can see that. It's to the right of this vertical line or to the right of the beat, and so on and so on. So instead of going to every note individually, I could do that or I could highlight certain notes, but what's even faster is just to come up here to the region, say edit, quantize, and I'm gonna say quantize to an eighth note because I was mostly playing eighth notes. And there we go. Now everything is perfectly on grid. You can see the beginning of those notes, the start of those notes line up perfectly with the grid. And now we can hear what that sounds like. Ta-da, there we go. So that's the simplest way of quantizing, but now let's talk about one other way, a kind of a, a special way that you can quantize that's specific to using drums. So if I mute this piano and I say add new track, add a drum track, and you'll see when you're playing the drums, you've got this auto quantize option. You can choose the rhythm here and you can tell it to either do it while you're playing or not. Um, or you can just totally turn this off. So if you specifically want a little bit of imperfection in your rhythm, which is sometimes really, really cool. If you don't want it to auto quantize, you just turn it off. Um, otherwise you choose your rhythmic value and then you'll play to that. Okay, so just a quick checklist. I've got my drum track added. It's record enabled. I've set auto quantize to an eighth note and I've turned while playing to off. So it's not gonna quantize exactly while I'm playing, but it will do it as soon as I stop playing. So here we go, click record and I'm gonna record my beat. Okay, so I just finished recording and let's hear how it auto quantized to an eighth note, the beat that I just played. Cool. So that's how you can quantize any thing that you play using any software instrument. That's the first thing I showed. And then if you're using drums, you have that special quantization thing to automatically quantize to a certain rhythm. Remember that you can either open the piano roll and quantize individual notes like that. Or if you just want to quantize everything, you can select that region, say edit and quantize everything quickly from here. That's it for how to quantize. See you in the next one.